you'd return to your seats. We're just about to kick everything back off. So if you want to come out of the, uh, the crying baby land in the back, that's what I love about churches. You know, they're not designed to be concert venues, but to me, whenever I'd go to church and they'd have that area in the back, I always called that crying baby land because that's where all the crying babies would go. It's like, oh, baby starts crying. You take him out there. They, you can still look inside. You can see everything going on, and, you know, probably they, you know, pipe the sermon out. Um, but that was crying baby land. But now it's free beer land. <laughs> so here's to the versatility of crying baby land. <laughs> Yeah, hallelujah, amen, and uh, that's actually an incredible opportunity to thank the O4 Center for hosting us again. Um, this, uh, this, this room, I, I mean, it, it feels like maybe it was built in the 50s, 60s, something like that, uh, but a few years ago, uh, Jason and Todd uh, reached out to the Methodist Convention and said, hey, we want some money to turn this into a concert venue. And they said, here you go. And they gave them a bunch of money, and they turned it into this incredible space uh, that celebrates life, that celebrates music, just like a church should. Um, and uh, I am supremely thankful that you've made this investment in our community and that you are supporting uh, uh, spiritually, uh, regardless of our denomination, uh, as Austinites. So please, uh, a, a toast, a hand, a cheer for the O4 Center. Thank you for having us out tonight. Uh, by the way, they have an amazing uh, programming season here. We hope to be back th here in the heat of summer when it's 171 degrees outside and uh, we can all be nice and cool uh, in the dark, literally and figuratively. Uh, by the way, the very first show we ever booked here, um, we had Jamie Harris and we had Megafauna. Yeah, so you can't beat female-led, like, hard metal, and that's what we brought. And I remember one of their uh, um, parishioners saying, I knew we were turning this into a venue, but I didn't know we were going to have this kind of music. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, welcome to Austin. So, that said, this next band, uh, we had them play for us before the pandemic. They are amazing. I was listening to them and uh, practically lost my way uh, on the way here, and I was just on Lamar because it's that awesome. Um, they released a single recently. They've got an album coming out later this year. Uh, for your consideration, ladies and gentlemen, Austin, Texas is very Mama Hawk. Ask me why is my favorite day of the week. 
Jolt awake again, minutes before the dawn. Got me working day and night, can't stop until we're done. Oh. Thanks, y'all. Thank you. 
Thanks, y'all. Visitors, but never 
Thanks, y'all. Thanks for being here. Uh, this next one is called Fighter Jet.
Thanks, y'all. So this next one is the single that we just put out. It's called Walk in the Fire. Um, you can find it wherever. But we just released this bad boy. It's fresh, fresh in the world.
much pull, it's a hell of a game. And you signed your indelible name on the line, you knew it would cross. Lost time isn't much of a lie. Here we go again, another walk in the fire. Cause you said I should have fled with something else. But I'd really rather just keep to myself. You put it Thanks, everybody. Cheers. Thanks to Sonic Guild for having us. All the Sonic Guilders. Guildians. Oh, okay. Guiltonians. Guilda Bears. That, you might have a little copyright there. Anyway, uh, <laughs> we're going to play one more. Thanks again for, for coming and listening. Um, we do have shirts and records and stuff, and we're, we're going to go hang out out there and drink beer with our shirts and records.
just when I died playing On a trip differing from the cars that you're riding playing On a path that was never truly Thanks, y'all. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Mama Hawk. Let's hear it. Um, one who uh, encouraged everybody to uh, go meet Mama Hawk out at the merch table uh, during the break, especially that salty son of a bass player right there. You did all of it, Mario. Come on now. I um, want to point out that we have incredible bands in town, but bands are made out of individual musicians, and the musicians in this town are badass, top-notch, world-class, and uh, just so thankful uh, to try to support all of y'all in whatever projects uh, they're involved with. Um, also th so thankful for Benny Keith, for bringing out all the beers and ready to drink uh, beverages tonight and to Tito's Handmade Vodka for pri providing the open bar. Uh, thank you so much for bringing the fun uh, on top of the love. We're gonna be back in just a few minutes with uh, someone who I would describe the Jupiter of Austin music. She is a creative force and you're gonna experience her in about 20 minutes. So have some fun, we'll be back soon, thank you.